If you've seen my video on making a fetch quest to deliver items, you'll be familiar with the setup for very basic item quests. In this tutorial, let's take it a step further by letting the player select an item from their inventory to give to an NPC. For this tutorial, I'm going to use a gifting system as an example. The NPC will be able to accept any item as a gift, but certain items will trigger a different response. You can use this for open-ended quests where the player can give the NPC one of many different items, or even relationship systems where the player can choose the best gift to give an NPC. First, you're going to need to set up your items in the database. For now, I'll use the default items that are set up in a blank project. You'll see that all of the potions here are given the item type regular item. This is important because the select item event command will ask you to choose which kind of item will appear in the menu. In your NPC event, add a new command for select item on page one. Create a new variable where the selected item ID will be stored. Name it anything you like to keep it memorable. I'm going to name mine select item ID. Then change the item type to regular item. This means that the menu which appears will only be able to select from the list of regular item types in the player's inventory. You can decorate these events with some dialogue too if you'd like. Now you'll need to make a conditional branch that checks the select item ID variable. The item ID for a regular potion is 7, so let's make a conditional branch that checks if the item selected was a potion. Remember that the conditional branch needs to check that the variable equals exactly 7. Inside the conditional branch, put the NPC's reaction to receiving the potion. You'll also need to use a change items command to remove it from the player's inventory. You can add more conditional branches to change the reactions for different items. Thanks for watching.